Hey, I'm Deckard, MovieLeaks.com. Here we are with the lovely Gillian. Hi, good to see you. I've got uh, questions. First question is, is first date a rom-com? Yeah. Okay, then I guess I don't have any other questions. Wow, Brittany, what's with your hair? It's huge. It's like that hair ate your other hair. Okay, FYI everyone, I'm feeling very insecure today and you know how I'm normally the most confident woman in America. Yes. Mm -hmm. yep. But yep. when this bitch comes to town? Gillian Jacobs? Doesn't everybody love her? That goblin face? Hell no. I kind of think she's a sweetheart. She's That's really cool. Kind of sexy. I mean, I like her. She's with. got a really good friend. smile. She's really like, cool. I don't know. She is a favorite. Well, trust me. She's like my best friend. She's awful. Oh, wait. That's right. You you were in that sitcom with her. Um, Blame it, blame it on I'm Baxter. Baxter. <laughs> yeah. Wait, you played... Fatty Fanny, yes. What kind of sick fuck comedy writer named an overweight 12 year old? Fatty, like that was my given name on the show. It's so fucked up. Oh my hey, God, hey, hey. I love it. It's okay, it's Take okay, it. hey, it's okay. Hey, what's up dork squad? Everyone is here. Okay, Kevin, honestly, don't start with me. Mmm, Fatty Fanny's got her panties in a bunch. Are you ready for your big reunion? Porky. I cannot even right now. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Gilly. What a blast from oh. the plot. Mm. Ow. Oh my god. It's so good to see you. Honestly, like I really missed you. Good to see you. You look amazing. Oh, so do you. Oh my god, your skin is so amazing. I wanna know like where you like a jacket. What? What? Oh my god, this is so exciting. Yes, very exciting first date. I <laughs> thought it was good. Oh, great. Yes. I'm so glad. Totally like, you know, not going to get a lot of praise. It's not going to like hurt your career too much. I always count on you to give me straight yes, up. Yes, because that's like our dynamic, right? Yeah, you're right? a little mean <laughs> and I just take it. I finally finished book 23 of the Glanthor saga. Oh, congratulations mm. on that. Am I supposed to be interested in that stupid book you're writing in your mom's basement about dragons? All right, they're not called dragons in Glanthor. They're called fire slugs. You all right, man? You don't look so hot. Do not mix tequila and cockfighting ever, boys. Well, that's funny because I had nine vodka crayons last night myself and I feel great. I also got up, ran seven miles, meditated, did a little manscaping all before 7 a.m. Did you get your scrotum too? <laughs> Yes. I brought you a gift. What? Don't feel bad if you didn't get me anything. I'm so, I'm humiliated. You've really shown me up. Okay, here it is. Oh, oh, oh my God. So that's us on the cover of TV tonight and that's me way in the front doing my signature pose and then that's Gillian. They put her like in the back and then the dog's even in front of Gillian. Yeah, this is amazing. I feel like I should sign this. Like, you'll always be fatty to me. That's good. Do you have a pen? I'll sign it right now. No, no, you don't need to put that on there. Can we just put this down here so it's not in the frame for the interview? Okay, sure. Sounds good. Thank you so you much. Maybe we could put it here. How do you not have Wi-Fi at the pool? Hey, um, I know I'm the new guy, so maybe I don't get it, but why are you all so miserable? What are you talking about? Just get me the fucking audition. We get to talk to movie stars in beautiful hotels with free food for cash money. Most people would kill for that chance. My young sweet battle on. We'll get you jaded yet. Yeah, I guess my big break was when I got into Juilliard. Do you remember when we auditioned together? Yes. Oh my God, how crazy would that be if you had gotten in instead of me? We would have just like swapped lives. Oh, gross. <laughs> I always wondered why you didn't get in. Do you think it's because you can't cry on cue? No, I can cry on cue. You can? Yeah, I didn't want to go to Juilliard. It was like too little stuffy. I wanted to go to City College. Why don't you just like cry in queue now if you can do it? I know, I'm going to. You just look like you're squinting. Hold on. Okay, I'm gonna give you a hint. I do it all the time. Just think about your career. But you have a great career. No, I think about your career. It's like. <laughs> I'm sorry. Like that. Um, so, so good to see you. Yeah, you too. 
Give me that, please. Just about as sweet as a fucking kick in the balls. How'd it go? Stop! Between love and loss, between men and women, it always begins with a first date. Gillian Jacobs, First Date.